Hey, what's up, Fish and Fools? All right, we're coming at y'all. It is a gloomy day, as y'all can see. But hey, don't let that stop you from ever fishing, because the fish are biting. Um, got these nice trout, decent. And you know, since I'm talking to y'all and I have fish, it's catching cook. What is this? Um, this is my buddy Jamie's fish, actually. Check this bad boy out. Nice stud. I have found the spot, and he came and caught the bigger fish. Go figure. But I'm, uh, we're going to break it down. I'm going to clean them here in a second. But I'm going to flip y'all back to about an hour, like four or five hours ago when we were catching them. Hey, it wasn't all I caught. I ended up catching today. Actually, y'all see what I caught. Catch you guys. Hey, <laughs> what's up, guys? All right. Um, Don't know if I'm going to catch anything today because I'm tide is very very low or like at the low second low uh, we're almost at low low tide I threw it in that current right there it's slowing out right now so I had to nibble a minute ago let me see if something just picks it up and slams it don't live shrimp so that tide's normally like two feet below that break so the brick lining right there, so still pretty low tide. Right there. We're after a species today. Drop a comment if you can guess it now. Some of y'all might be able to. I'm after two species, but I'll settle if I catch one. Got a thump, got a thump. I think we're on. We're on. Don't know what it is. Oh, that's a nice trout. Oh, oh, oh that's a whoa, that's a solid, solid trout. Heck yeah. That's not what I was expecting, but. And that wasn't the species we're after, man. Look how let's see how big he is. Alright, um Man, he's nice. So I don't know. I just, he's decent. I'm gonna have to get him out. I'm gonna go take him. Oh wow! I'll tell you what, that was about an insta bite. It's a nice one. I don't know if he'll keep. Uh, I'll check. It's a nice little guy. Nice little guy. Oh, he look like he got hit by something. He ain't gonna keep though. GoPro. Not fine. Um. Let's let him go. Now I gotta go get some more shrimp. GoPro, stop recording. Well, that's a good one. He's digging. Oh, wow, that's a nice stud. They're fat boys. Oh, bow flipper die, baby. God dang, that's a nice fucking trout. Bro. Golly. So. Bro, this is a stud. <laughs> I 
we go. Just got real tight. Oh, we're on, we're on. Where do you go? Where do you go? Where you? He's going to tour me. We're good. Let's save the species, the species, the species. Let's That's catch the red. the red fish, the red fish, the red fish. Yeah. Did I bring the pliers? Oh, I forgot. Oh, there, there. Hand me them pliers real quick. Huh? Hand me those pliers. This guy swallowed it. I know he did. What pliers? Right there. On the phone and catch a fish. <laughs> oh, oh y'all see that? I just almost ate ass. <laughs> little 16 inch fish. Yeah, somewhere around there. Oh, you little sh shovel. Hand me them pliers, please. Hmm. We will see, we will see, we will see. Put it where you want it. Huh? Put it where you want it. Oh, it's your bait, so. Put it where you want it. Uh, okay. <sighs> oh shit. One more, I'm at a limit. <laughs> I would be at a limit if I didn't lose that last one, but. <laughs> you ain't gotta put your thumb on it. Get bigger. A little rat. Hey, Mike. Oh. Took your hook. Yeah, he wasn't a keeper though. He was about 18. Right here, one second. Lay down, lay him down real quick. Oh. Hold on, I'm one second. Him. Ooh, got you something. <laughs> it's a sheep head. He's. I don't think that's legal. Is no, it? he's not. But hey, it's what I was after. <laughs> oh, we're trying to measure a fish and get a sheep head. All we need is a legal uh, flounder to go onto this. Uh, Trust me. I wish. Go for it. I have no clue what we just got. Uh, my drag is... <laughs> you felt way bigger, buddy. Go for a stop Yo, recording. All right, guys, we're gonna go ahead and uh, knock these bad boys out. Um, well, Jamie's right there. I'd say this was like 18, 18 and a half, I mean 17 and a half, somewhere around there, both of them. But some studs, man, that's a big one. Definitely my, some of my biggest this year, so. You know how I do it. Start there. Yeah, cleaning trout is easy. Take that knife, run down that back. Gotta scare the heck out of me. And, oh, he ain't got anything in his stomach, dude. Being land shark fishing over here, looking to see if he has any stomach, stuff in his stomach. But man, he's just, look at that belly meat! Whoa! 
Holy moly. This is a solid fish. This is what you want in the bag. play music on those skiff skin and we're gonna feed him to our lucky buddies, Mr. Kelly. And I'm pretty sure all y'all know the rest of this. Um, quick little process here. Guys. Right in front of it. Fools, we in the kitchen. We cooking. Already got the fry started. I started on those early, so right now we're gonna turn up the heat over here. Um, we're making a trout poor boy. If I pronounce that wrong, it's my it's my language. So um, we got one trout fillet. I'm gonna do the rest later, but this is just for video's sake. I'm gonna add some mustard to my mix. Boom. One egg. Franks, Red Hot Original, about that much. Now I'm gonna grab a fork real quick. And whisk that, whisk it up, make some, make a concoction. All right, cool, 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 cool. That's that. Put this in the sink. I'm going to add Tony's lemon pepper, <gasps> excuse me, garlic salt. And we're using Come On Man Fish Fry. Woo, I just got a nose full of flavor. Mix it up. Hands are clean, guys. Don't worry about that. Nice red, nice trout. Mix it up, 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 mix it up. Batter, batter, batter. Um, I'm gonna double batter this one or not? If y'all know, if y'all wonder who I'm talking to, my boy Jamie's behind the camera. Y'all know who he is. He's in a lot of my videos. We're gonna double batter this. My hands are gonna be messy after this. But the fish is gonna be good. When you double batter, guys, make sure you got your temperature real high because you want your batter to crust up before anything else. You don't want it to get soggy and your fish not be done. So you want your you want your temperature high. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, knock, um, wash my hands, and then I'll get back for y'all in a second. Guys, we're gonna add some shrimp to our pool boy. Gotta take my oil. Yes, it does say vinegar. Roll up my pan, take it, there we go, Tony's, lemon pepper, all right, I can put these back here, that one's hot, it just got super hot, um, all right, Putting the about to put the fish in. Go for a pop quarter. All right, guys, we're gonna fry our fish. Probably should use a little bigger pan, but it should be fine. Always tilted away from you. That is hot. That's why I mean you when you grease hot. I'm gonna turn it down a little bit now. Oh, 
We're going to toast our bread and everything. Um, right now, I'm going to clean up my mess. But I'm, uh, these guys are cooking right now. And give me a moment. I'm going to go ahead and get some stuff cleaned out of the way. And I'll get back to you guys when I'm pulling the fish. And I'm messing with oop, the bread. All right, guys. So we got some bacon here. We're going to add bacon to this poor boy. You know, it, it's... I can't make anything without bacon. So this is jalapeno bacon. I've never had this before. Go ahead. Yes, it's overhanging, but it's going to shrink up. So it's going to shrink into smaller pieces. So I'm going to do put two on there for now. Uh, yeah, look, I'll show you this. Look at that. All the nice seasoning up top is crazy. I'm going to do two for now, and I'll put the rest on here in a minute. But um, um, the trout is... Um, it's black because I put a lot of seasoning on it, and the grease may have been, uh, just been a tad bit too hot for this. So I'm gonna let it finish out. It's almost done, and then I'm uh, I'll catch you guys in a minute when I'm working on the bread. All right, guys, we're gonna go ahead and uh, cut the bread open. I did some magical things with the bacon. I fried it. I'm going to see how that comes out. I've never done it before. Kind of make like chicharron bacon pieces. So, got that. I'm going to melt some butter down. If y'all can see how smoky my house was right now. Bacon. Right. Alright guys, I'm gonna finish toasting these and I'll get back to you guys when we're plating. Alright guys, we're gonna add our sauces to this. Um I'm gonna do tartar sauce just as my base. Nothing fancy. Oh, dropped a little bit. Oh, okay, good thing. Good thing. Good thing. Good thing, good thing, good thing. Because I need some on the top too. So there we go. I'm just gonna spread around the tartar sauce. This is our fish. Oh, look how look how perfect that's cooked, guys. Yes, it is crispy. I know. I burnt it a little bit, but it's cooked. Tastes still tastes still gonna taste good. Add our shrimp to it. Yeah, I'm going a little extra, guys. I added the shrimp. If it feels like I'm going fast, it's because I am. Just throwing that out there, guys. Cool. Um. Got this jalapeno bacon. I did burn the bacon, but I'm, I'm a big fan of crispy bacon. So I got the bacon. Got the shrimp. I was going to add avocado. Now that I'm in the middle of, middle of it, I'm like, I'm not doing that. So, um, some more tartar sauce. Go ahead and top that bad boy. I forgot spinach. Oh, well. Video sake. One second, guys. Got to get the last bit. Boom. Sprinkle it off a little Tony's. And there we go, guys. Speckled trout pull boy with bacon and shrimp and fries. I'll catch y'all guys. Uh -huh. Check it out. I know I just seen it the whole video. It's the end. I should have said something earlier. Yep, hold on, hold on. It's not set in stone. None of this stuff is set. This is all playing where you I'm starting to make my own shirts here at the house, so we're learning how to do it. But I'm, uh, if y'all want to see Jamie's video from today, uh, his will be linked down below. Uh, we filmed it as we're filming this one. So um, until next time, guys, I'll catch all y'all on the next episode of Fat Man's Fishing.